He is one of the best heavyweights in the world, Paris Francis Cyril Gaon, and that infectious smile certainly gets wiped away on fight night, but this is a guy who absolutely enjoys competition as much as any heavyweight on this roster. Figures have a striking advantage in this matchup and in most matchups in the heavyweight division, but most of these guys, if they have it in their repertoire, are gonna try to take him down. So what has he done? Gon's gone back to the drawing board. He has spent so much time working on his wrestling and takedown defense that he believes his sprawl is going to show up large here tonight. Bon Gama, Sidel Gon has graced the octagon. He is ready to fight. So here he is, the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion, Tom Aspinall. He has put UK on the map. And certainly Michael Bisping and Leon Edwards deserve a lot of credit. But now the UK has a heavyweight champion. And he hasn't even arrived at his fighting prime. We heard a lot about the grappling of Tom Aspinall and just how good he was in that realm. But his striking is outstanding. He's got the power to go with the speed. He moves as well with the footwork as any heavyweight on the roster. And that's really the big challenge for the opposition here tonight. Power to be sure on the other side, but how are they going to keep up with Tom Aspinall with the lateral movement, the jab, and everything else that he presents and poses on the feet? Well, so much UFC history has played out here at T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. Plenty more where that came from tonight. The athletes are ready to go. Our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. So her being third man in there Ready. for this one. While well, Tommy Aspinall's fans travel well as we get to some early action here, a lot of people believe that this is the future of... Oh my Back to his feet. Oh my goodness. Some real power shots here. Setting up the arm bar here. Beautiful setup on that arm bar. Oh, looks like he's got the arm isolated. He's got it isolated, working toward the finish. Well, MMA is a constant exercise in risk mitigation, right? But it would seem to me that if he really goes for it. He's got to try to finish here. Guns. That's it. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. The official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 59 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. And still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. All right, so we hear and still tonight, our UFC 